The police and fire services are continuing their investigations into a fire in Buxton that claimed the life of a 71-year-old amputee. The man identified as Dennis Marks was trapped in the blaze in his small home. Fire Chief Marlon Gentle today told Capital News that initial reports indicate that the fire started from activities the man was doing inside the building at the time. He said that the investigation also revealed that the man was behaving erratically for a number of days and once he attempted to burn the building. Gentle said that the fire service got a call around 6.25 on Wednesday and immediately rushed to the scene. He said support was also provided by the Ghana Sugar Corporation, but their best efforts could not rescue the victim or save the building. I heard that my father was on fire and I had to run and come now I see the house done burning. Down and you know, I think he must cause the fire by doing something. How do you think he caused the fire? What, what, what do you think? He smoked cigarettes and some you know, of this something happened, you know? What you saw happen? No, I saw it on the line and I see smoke come in the air and I say, man, this got to be a fire. So I really don't come to the front. I'm like, I don't come to the front. Next five minutes, it, it truck down the air. Residents are saying that the man was suffering from diabetes and was frustrated over his sickness. Reporting for Capital News, Royston